Hello, my name is Daryl Pace. And the topic of my presentation is Electronic Learning Trends Connected Classrooms ePals. As you can see, I've used the grayscale background theme with uh, a blue oval that has a gold border. I chose white lettering for my type because it seems to stand out and draws attention. For slide two, I've maintained the grayscale theme. The blue oval on top still has the topic header and it's uh, with white lettering and has a gold border. On the left, and there's an arrow pointing down to a gold box with a blue border that has network director in it. In the center, I have another gold box with a blue border and its subtitle is administrators with blue type. The third box on the right is students. It's also gold with a blue border with a blue arrow coming down from the topic pointing to it and it also has blue type. With my third slide I've maintained the grayscale background theme. Uh, the topic header is still in a blue oval with gold border and the lettering inside that is white. Uh, follow it down to network director which is still a gold box with a blue border. Below network director there's two boxes the first one is Internet Portal, and the second one is Student Tracking. Both of these boxes are blue with a gold border, and I've used white lettering on them. Below Administrators, you see Grants, which is a blue box with uh, gold bordering with white lettering, and Educators, which is the same. Below Students, you have uh, Participate, which is in a blue box with a gold border with white type, and Respect, which is the same as Participate. My fourth slide has the same basic format as the previous three. And there's a grayscale background theme, and the topic of my presentation is still in a blue oval with white lettering. The, basically, the first three rows are the same. Underneath Internet Portal, we've added a box that has speed in it. The box is gold with a blue border, and speed is important for maintaining a, a constant Internet Portal. Under Student Tracking, we have a gold box with a blue border that has Edmodo in it which is a form of social network primarily related just to the school and grades. Under grants we have federal. Federal grants are the main source of funding outside of uh, taxes. Under educators we have lesson plans which is in a gold box with blue lettering and a blue border. Under participate we have parents. Uh, parents need to understand what uh, ePals is about and you know obviously allow their students to participate. Uh, response is underneath respect and it's primarily an idea that they, the students need to be responsible or and respond appropriately. My fifth slide incorporates all of the material that was in the first four slides with the same grayscale background theme. And underneath speed, we have a blue box that is in a gold border with white lettering, and it says safety. The next one under Edmodo is iPad apps, and it's also in a blue box with a gold border. And it's basically there so that the network administrator can approve the apps that are put on the iPads to schools via the students. Underneath federal, there are business. Uh, business is another type of grants that schools can get, and it's another source of funding after taxes. Underneath educators, you have tests, and the tests should be interactive so that they can be taken by people through the ePals network that are possibly on the other side of the world. Under parents, you have accept. Parents need to accept technology and understand that ePals is an effective way for their children to learn and interact with people from all over the world. Maintain is under response and it may seem out of place but response I felt was more important and maintenance is an important thing also but it's kind of last on my list and basically it's about the students maintaining the equipment that they have been given by the school. The sixth and final slide at this time is the bibliography. It's currently empty, 
But whenever I finish my major presentation, there will be between five and ten peer-reviewed uh, sources. Thank you.